about this okay movie. i'm expecting this uh, yeah okay you're not expecting this only <laughs> yeah so at, at that time uh, like i got to know about the bone conduction technology which is, which our products are based on right now okay. on the channel of techy sms can i say we here uh, has some contribution from techy sms yeah it it played a crucial part at the beginning of the journey right yeah, that was uh, very much uh, glad I'm glad to hear that i am i am being you know uh, not physically but still i am a part of uh, we here and many other uh, students and that companies maybe so that kind of thing motivates me to make more such content and bring more such innovative you know videos Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Talking Tech powered by LCSC Electronics. Now in this Talking Tech series I used to invite some tech startups and companies most related to the field of electronics, IoT and automation. I invite them at Tech ESM Studio and ask them about their product, their journey, their business strategy and everything related to that product and their company. So for this episode we have Mr. Kanish Patel who is the CEO and founder of We Here Hearing Solutions. So thank you so much Kanish for being here at Tech ESM Studio. Yeah, yeah, thank you so much for inviting me as well. So before I throw some questions over Kanish, let me give you a brief about the V here so V here is a company that focuses on the products related to bone conduction technology okay so right now they are working on a bone conduction based bluetooth headphones what they call as bone phones yeah so that current product is bone phone so kanish uh, let our viewers know how V here happened what was how was the journey okay so we here is our actually it's our second company it's second so, startup yeah so before okay. that uh, we some the company we were working on is was named automate okay so it was a automatic home cleaning machine and okay. like you can clean your home from anywhere in the world okay. so that was the okay. product okay. so like okay. we we made it for 4 to 5 months and okay. Okay. then we did some market research and like we got we realized that it's a bit early for indian market to accept that product so okay. then we thought of pivoting to some other product as well so at that time like we were tinkering on many ideas we had some ideas in our mind and we were also searching on internet that what are the problems of people and what we can do about that okay, okay, and okay. at that time like uh, we came to know about this okay i'm like, expecting this uh, yeah okay you're not expecting this only <laughs> yeah so at, at that time uh, like i got to know about the bone conduction technology which is, which our products are based on right now okay. on the channel of techy sms and so like we were very much amazed by technology that how and i was amazed while working on yeah, that yeah exactly so like it was it was very cool at first first look yeah exactly. how it's working it is it is so we were so like we were very much excited and we started building a prototype from scratch whatever whatever we had at our office and we right. just we just right. made a small prototype which we which plays some music using that technology okay, so okay, okay. like we went to people and we just put that uh, transducer right. on their head and just we were playing music and like telling people how cool it is like we we don't have that idea that we are going to build a product from that and so at that time uh, someone from our team told us that let's try it on people who are who are who are having issues in their physical part of it as, as the, in this technology the sound is bypass by uh, sound bypasses whole your physical ear system exactly right? exactly so we went to the school for hearing impaired people at uh, amdavad so what we did was we we just ran very small ta- tests on the students they had at that time 8 nice. to 9 students nice. so what we did was we just played some music on them and so there was a 10 year old kid who was uh, hearing impaired by birth Ooh. so we played some music on him and so he didn't understand music exactly but he was like he was feeling something like he something is playing or transfer yeah something is yeah. playing inside his yeah, head yeah, and yeah, yeah. so he started joining uh, like he started dancing with joy and nice. so that was the moment that we thought we should work on that product this is the product we wanted to work okay okay so that was nice so so can i say we here uh, has some contribution from techy sms yeah it it played a crucial part at the beginning of the journey right yeah, that was uh, very much glad glad to hear that i am i am being you know uh, not physically but still i am a part of uh, we here and many other uh, students and that companies maybe so that kind of thing motivates me to make more such content and bring more such innovative you know videos on my channel yeah that was really amazing to hear this okay so can is my next question is uh, just tell the audience is about the specification of your product you know how your product okay. what your product is built on yeah so our product bone phones work on works on bone conduction technology nah, so yeah. uh, it is built in tra- bone conduction transducer that we develop at our office and we are manufacturing partners in gujarat only okay so apart from that uh, it is a bluetooth chip of qualcomm okay qualcomm csr okay. Uh, 
and it has like 200 mAh battery nice. so it works for around 8 hours play time okay. so technically speaking if you use it for 2 3 hours a day it works for 5 to 6 days a week oh that's nice that's so nice. on a single charge and it has standby time of around 20 days and Ooh. so it, it also it is also available in four different colors okay so the one is uh, classic blue uh, another is classic gray then it's it also has forest green and the last one is dark magenta okay so like okay. we have color for your each passion that's right. yeah that, that was a tag that was, yeah, yeah one of our marketing campaigns right yeah other than colors if i personally talk about that product then before starting this video i just you know felt i just used that product and it feels really good and when you wear it the material use is very soothing and yeah that's that's really nice yeah you know product design yeah. is really good i just loved yeah. it okay so moving on to the next question Kanish, let me know the purpose of your product you know purpose of the your first product as well as the bone phones you know how, how you you know uh, diverted into the bone conduction okay. and everything yeah so so we had we here we call ourselves as a hearing care company okay. so hearing our first care. product sense which was a hearing aid product right uh, so that was for like uh, solving the issue of hearing uh, loss right, to the right, people right, helping right. them uh, to hear better oh. and the so like so we are in as we are in this field we were doing a lot of research about the market what is the uh, like what are the stats and what is the market for hearing right. impaired people right, right. so we came we came to know that uh, from a survey of world health organization and as well as some prestigious companies of united states so we got to know that like 15 percent of their youth will be having some some sort of hearing loss by just 2022 is it and it's only because of like excess use of earphones and headphones oh, wow. so the earphones and headphones you are losing right now they are they they may be damaging your ears so that was the thing so in our in our technology like it physically it bypasses the physical ear part yeah yeah it's totally so, bypasses yeah so like if you listen for a much longer time using it still it doesn't damage any part of your physical ear so that was the ear health friendly thing was the one thing which is the main motivation of yeah. main goal of the company and apart from that like our product has many uh, what you can say many advantages like so you can listen while while your ears are open Right, so right, it, right. it's very much useful in many cases like when you are driving away exactly right? exactly so there are many cases where you need it to be right aware. right so you can hear the music with an open ear wow, yeah that's, exactly. that's a nice that's a nice thing so Kanesh, my next question comes from a student okay. yeah so this question for all the startups basically so what the question is do college studies involved in this companies or involved in this startup? Yeah, do college or the uh, what you can say, theoretical studies are important? What's your opinion on this? Okay, so yeah, so when I was a student in college, I, I used to think same like that. Ki, yeah, the part, the practical knowledge is right. the main key. Right. Theories right. are it's okay if you okay. if you skip the theories, it's okay. Exactly. So, uh, but yeah, what what I can say is like if you are so when we went in. To the, the next part yeah. for the product development, right. the final product development. Then we then we realize that yeah, the theories are a bit important in many cases. Is it? So like what I say is the practical knowledge is the first priority, but there should be some some sort of uh, theory knowledge yeah, as well. Okay. That's what my view is. So if that. I put a scale of one to ten, then how much you will give to theory? So like if we use the two different scales, if one is for practical, then it's nine out of ten. But okay. the theory is six out of ten. I guess. Oh, okay. So that's a scale from Kanesh. Yeah. So yeah, that that is uh, interesting. So we'll take a break here, and after the break, I will take the questions from subscribers, and I will also ask Kanesh about how is the market of bone conduction headphones, and who are the competitors, and everything about that particular market. So let's take a break here. Joy, what happened? Shit, man. These components are not working. Seriously? From where you ordered it? I just bought it from a local supplier. How you can do that without having any trust on the components, man? Dude, no worry. Listen one thing. For your next project, do try out lcsc.com which has the component from the most genuine companies like Texas Instruments, On Semiconductors and many more. So you can get the most genuine components from there. Okay, is that so? So how can I order components? I will let you know. Ordering components from LCSC is very simple. Just search for what you want on the website, add them to the cart and place your order. Within 4 hours, your order will be ready to be shipped. They not only deliver fast, 
but also take care of your order by properly packing everything with the labels on it. So try out LCSC for your electronic component purchases. So welcome back to the Talking Tech episode 2 and before the break we discussed about uh, the V here company, their product, bone phones, specifications and all that stuff. So uh, Kanish, I have one segment in which I ask, uh, you know, I take the questions from my subscribers uh, regarding your product, regarding the company or regarding the startup, everything, okay. So I have a couple of questions from my subscribers which I forward to you. So the first question is, as your product sends vibration to skull directly, so is it safe to use without doctor's prescription or does it affect our brain? Okay, yeah, so uh, as you know, it works on a bone conduction technology and this technology is a uh, medical approved technology in, in almost all the countries in the world. So uh, it, the main use of the technology is uh, in the healthcare segment and it's the the, tech, the vibration we send are very very much controlled and that doesn't damage any part of your brain or ear so it's a medically approved technology okay. even in you even it's used in the products of healthcare so it's a completely safe and approved technology okay so it doesn't affect so it, it, it doesn't affect your any any part, any part of brain oh, ear yeah. anything oh, yeah. okay that's nice so Kanish, the next question comes is, uh, any plans for future updates for this device, for both phones or any product, any future updates? Okay, so uh, so as, as I said, we are a hearing tech company. So we are, we are, we are doing a lot of R&D on audio and sound processing part. Okay. So for particularly for the bone phones, we are working on one or two things. So our team is also working on an app which connects with your bone phone. Okay. So like okay. you can personalize your bone phones right, uh, right, by right. by that app. So you can set the equalizers, you can set the button functions from okay, your okay. knee. And so recently we also embedded the uh, Google Assistant and Siri with right, it. Right, so right. like, uh, like, like you can do anything. You can uh, you can use navigation from there. You can ask questions. You right. so we are making it personalized for people. Okay. As well. So so that, that that is the thing we are working on. So right next now. target is to make an app that can personalize each bone phones according to the user. Yeah. So right. and even also so we have built. Uh, uh, what you can say machine learning based technology where uh, yeah, like your bone phone will adapt the pattern of your hearing and it, right. it can adjust itself as well. Okay. So that thing is in very initial stage right now but it, it may be like in the market in 3 to So three long story short you are moving towards personalization part. Yeah right? Right. for the bone phone. Right. Exactly. Yeah. Nice that's nice. Okay the next question comes is uh, do you have any patent for this and if yes then what's the procedure of filing a patent? Okay, we so yeah, so we have one provisional patent for our first product. So it was a process patent. So like process patent is the so so we have filed the provisional patent for that. So process patent is the patent for the way you are doing the things. Okay. So like uh, what is the flow of uh, what is my flow diagram of the product? Right, how product right, is right. in which flow product is working? Right. So that is the process patent, and we have filled one provisional for that. And what's the procedure if you have to tell in very short then what's the procedure? Yeah, so uh, if, if so if I say for particularly for India, okay. so you have to like you have to fill a form for a provisional patent like okay. if you have So first of all the first key is to search for the patent and there are search for the already available patents Okay, so okay. there are like many platforms like Google patents then WIPO is the thing for uh, patent searching okay. so like you can you can put the keywords in the search tab and you can find all the related patents and so so that is for the validation that you have something unique than already available thing. Okay, okay. After that like you have to fill a form for provisional patent and so you, you have to file that provisional patent and after that like uh, you can have a maximum time of one year to make that pit, like make that idea into reality okay, and you have okay. to prove that the your right of this patent. Okay, okay. So that is the generally the one year is the time period for India okay. and there are different according different to countries. the different countries. Okay, yeah. nice. Okay, so guys, the next question comes is how difficult it was for you to decide the price of the product looking at this competitive market? Okay, yeah. So talking about the competition first. Okay. So 
so like if if we say about the direct competition so there are no no, no manufacturers or no company in india who are working on particularly this segment the whole production is it yeah so we oh. are the only one right now in the indian market that, that's amazing so but yeah there are two to three companies globally okay, uh, so okay. one is a california based company and another one is a europe based company okay, so okay. like like when it came to deciding the price uh, so we we at very initially we realized that india is a very price sensitive market Obviously, in terms of exactly. any products exactly. so so what we did was the competitors had some products in the similar segment that around 12 to 15000 rupees if, oh. if we convert it into inr it's 12 to 15000 rupees but cool. as we knew that as we know that india is not like so india is not the market for them so right. like we worked on uh, our product our pricing strategy uh, that way that like we can make it affordable for indians as, indians well. as well so right. like currently our pricing is mrp is 4999 okay uh, but so it, it's uh, like right now we are selling it on many discounts and offers right 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 so so this is the way we like we did a lot of market research as well to decide the price as well yeah so basically your goal was an indian market only and you, you decided yeah, the price yeah for now our, yeah. so we made our price according to that according only. to the indian market okay that that's nice okay uh moving on to the uh, next and the last question from my subscriber is uh, what's the legal procedure of a start being a startup basically it's a startup related question not a company specific pro- question so what is the legal procedure of starting your own company or a startup okay. do we need to take patents before starting the company if yes then what's the procedure so just guide okay. about how do we you know start our own startup yeah so like first of all it's it's a very great time to start a startup because okay, like okay. people are very it's a new hot word in the right, industry right. that startup is something something cool if you right, right. should do that even governments promoted exactly so there are there are many schemes for startups as well like uh, even if for the student startups government have different policies and so like if you have any idea and if you if you are thinking of starting up then uh, my first suggestion is like to meet the people in the ecosystem and the best place to meet the people in ecosystem is the incubation centers right so right. there are many incubation centers in the country so you can just reach to them or uh, so they have a already established ecosystem mm-hmm. so like uh, even if you like if you go with your idea they may guide you the first the first thing they may guide you with is uh, like is the uh, is the idea really workable or not okay, okay so like they they may help you in doing market research and all this thing right. after that like they have many mentors in each phase in a right. product development in marketing in even in legal legal terms of the company right. so all so they may have all the uh, what you can say they may have all the facilities over there so right, like right. the easiest way to start is to meet some incubation centers that's right. what i think okay and uh, and he, even uh, someone asked about patent as well exactly so, so it's, it's not the question needed. is patent is needed before starting the company or we can start yeah, without any patent that, that's not the thing uh, the patent is not needed to start the company but yeah if you have the patent then it's okay like you can file a patent without like being the owner of a company but it's not needed to have a patent before starting okay. the company so you can always file the patent after you establish the company and or during your journey yeah, yeah. Okay, so okay there is no time to file the patent okay okay so i uh, talk about the procedure is the so your suggestion is to first find out on incubation center and uh, they will yeah that's the easy, easiest way that i think yeah that's amazing then the last segment are uh, talking about your product then uh, how people can uh, you know connect with you can buy your product so where is your product on okay. sale so right now we we sell our product on our website Okay. and uh, so we are we are very soon going for the amazon as well okay. so it will be available most probably on from the last week of september on amazon but right now you can buy it from our website and so we have like we ship products in 2 to 3 days after the order okay that's amazing so it was nice talking to you mr yeah, kanesh yeah, it was an amazing session we had a lot of question and answers and we got to know lot of things about your product about the startup market so this was all about the second episode of talking tech and uh, if you are new to my channel uh, make sure you subscribe because i used to come with this talking tech series and other than talking tech series i also used to make some innovative and amazing uh, electronics iot related project tutorials i used to make some uh, getting started videos on new sensors and new uh, products and some short but useful tips and tricks so just wait for my next video and then explore learn share with me techie sms